Hey, this is Frank from Max Digital, and I wanted to shoot you over this little video with some specific things that you guys can do in-house to help you bring in more business, but better utilizing both your website and your Google business profile. I noticed you were doing some advertising in the Greensboro area, so I had done a search on plumbers in Greensboro NC, and this is the search results uh, page that came up. So there's three sections to the search results page. The first is advertising section, so you have to be paying Google to be in this section. Um, but you want to be in as many sections of these, many of these three sections as possible, since most people aren't going to click to page two of the results. So um, if you're not in the advertising section, then the next section down is the what's known as the Google Map Pack. And the, there's only three or four businesses that ever get listed here. And it's Google lists the ones with the strongest Google business profile. So there's a couple things you can do to increase your the strength of your uh, profile with Google. One is to fill out the profile completely by adding your name, address, phone number, hours of service, hours of, I'm sorry, hours of service, uh, services provided, uh, getting good customer reviews, responding to the reviews, uh, and uploading photos um, periodically as well. The second thing you can do that's super important is to have your business listed in, in as many online directories as possible. But at least um, you want to beat out uh, that number that your competitors are listed in by about 100 or so directories. So those are called citations. And um, there's a lot of different directories online. Angie's List, uh, Yelp.com, Nextdoor, HomeAdvisor.com. Uh, there's thousands of directories that you could list your business in. And many of them are free to list in. Uh, it's just a matter of going and taking the time uh, to go and enter your business information into all of those directories. That is something that we could help with if, if you wished. Um, the third section of the search results page is the organic section. Uh, so to be in this section here, um, it requires a couple different things. So let me, once I get past uh, the first couple directories here, Angie's List and BBB and Yelp, I get to actual business websites that are listed. So Go Green Plumbing is the number one plumbing website in Greensboro, North Carolina. And to be uh, in this section here, it's based on two different things. One is the content of your website, and the second is backlinks associated with your website. And we're gonna talk about both of those. So the first thing I wanted to talk about was content. So I see your site here. The site looks great, super professional. Um, I did notice though that there is about 900 words on here. Google is looking for about 1,500 to 2,000 words on the home page for it to consider you as an expert or your site as an authoritative site. Um, your competition has roughly that amount. Uh, again, your competition is gogreen.com. Uh, they have a lot of content on their site, and so I think Google looks at them as the expert. Um, but it's not just about the amount of content that you have on your site. Your content actually also needs to be embedded uh, and be dense in uh, what's known as local buyer intent keywords. So those are keywords uh, that you want your site to be found for by those that will be searching for your service. Um, and when I say local buyer intent, uh, it's good that your site, I mean, sorry, that your keywords reference both the service you provide and the location you provide it in because that's generally what somebody who's looking for a service is going to type into the Google search bar. So I use a site called Eros to look at the analytics of your site. So here's your site here, and this shows me some of the statistics behind it. Your site is currently ranking for 26 keywords. And when I click into those keywords, I see they actually are uh, local buyer and tank keywords. It looks like you want your site to be found for uh, septic tank cleaning, sump pump installation, drain pipe installation. So it's got a lot of the services that you provide and the uh, area that you provided in, which is great. Um, here I see your plumbing services down here. So you have the right idea with uh, how the content was, was drafted up. Um, again, I think you want to increase the amount of content that you have on your site um, because you probably need to bump it up by, I probably double the amount of content so you can beat out Go Green Plumbing and what they have for content. Um, you are currently ranked um, between 20 and then, you know, 50, 62, I guess looks like your highest ranking here for, for plumbing services. 
So that's really like page six or seven of the results page. So you really want to get that up and be on page one, like we said, because most people never go past page one on the results. Um, but there's another thing um, that, that I mentioned earlier that is driving your, your ranking, and that is known as backlinks. So here, um, backlinks are just merely links from another site over to your site. And they act as an endorsement of, of your site by that other site. And so Google looks to see how many backlinks you have. Google's kind of a popularity contest. So the more uh, links you have over to your site from other sites, it shows you as being more popular, so to speak, or that you are a trusted and relevant website that people would refer to you um, if, they were, if they were speaking about plumbing or septic tank cleaning or something like that. Um, so you want to try to get as many backlinks as possible and you want them to be from relevant sites or, or strong sites that Google already views as a trusted site. These scores right here are uh, scores for trust and, and site power that Google assigns to your site or to every site. And strong sites are usually in the 30 to 40 range. So you can see yours is significantly lower. Um, you could look at, let's look at your competitor here, Go Green Plumbing. They have... I looked at their keywords. They also have the uh, bar, local buyer intent keywords around plumbing. Uh, they don't have the septic drain cleaning and everything like you guys do. Um, but they do have a significant amount of backlinks here, 2,400 backlinks coming from 178 referring domains. So that is providing a lot of power to their site and enabling them to uh, be the number one, number one ranked plumbing site uh, for Greensboro. And you can see that not only are they number one in the organic listing, but they are also mentioned here. They're one of the uh, sites listed in the Google Map Pack. And you can see that they're also whoops, listed at the top here in the advertising section. So they are covering all their bases and, and they're getting a lot of uh, business as a result of that. Um, you can see they're getting 2,200 clicks a month in traffic. And so Imagine if you could just get a slice of that and what that would do to your to your bottom line and to ultimately yeah, your bottom line and your revenue. So um, hopefully that was helpful. Uh, you're free to use this information and implement the strategies yourself. If you would like some help with it, uh, I would be I would love to assist you in it. Uh, and I'll leave my contact information in the email. So other than that, have a great day. Thank you.